What is up, up, up and away, guys? This is Caitlin from Caitlin Says. Today's video is going to be pros and cons of being an adult. So for those of you who don't know, I'm 20. I'm just finishing that bracket of like teenagehood, but still legally an adult now. And lately I've been noticing more and more differences, I guess you could say. List four pro, pro I'm gonna list four pros and four cons. Pro numero uno, having your own money. Now for those of you who have gotten your work permit since you were like 16 or 15 and a half, you know what this is like. But when you turn it into an adult, I seriously went to my mom and I was like, I am so sorry I ever asked you for anything money-wise. Because money is, it's hard to earn. Especially when you earn it, you are so much more grateful for it. It goes a lot quicker when you're an adult too. Pro, having your own money, being able to do what you want with it, not having to rely on parents anymore. Pro number two, getting to do more things. You remember when you were younger and there were like things that you wanted to do but you couldn't because you just weren't old enough? You get to drive in a car without a person over 21 just because you are now an adult. Pro number three, you're able to get better jobs. You know those jobs that you want, like that promotion you want maybe at work? And it's like you have to be a certain age to get that promotion. Sometimes it's even like 21, so maybe you have to wait a little bit longer. But most times you can get hired any job as long as you're 18. And most times you're able to get that better job, which if you work and you like working, that's a good thing if you get a job you really want just because you want to do something that makes you happy. Pro number four, improvements in ways that you had to wait, like going on a missions trip, going to Africa, or just going and helping out and volunteering someplace that you had to wait to be an adult to do. You could definitely improve yourself that way by gaining new skills, having a new outlook on life, being able to go and say, I've been out of the country, I've done this, I've helped people, and it's changed who I am. Now, it's on to the con. Con number one, having to work. When you are an actual full-fledged adult, especially if you live on your own, you have now entered into the point where you're in work purgatory. Meaning that you always have to work. There's no getting out of it. You always have to support yourself unless you become rich and famous or stumble across a million dollars. Then you don't have to work. If you're the normal human being, you'll have to work. Sometimes you'll have to work on weekends, you have to work night shifts, and it does suck some of your time. That brings me on to my next con number two. Bill. When you're under 18, you do have some bills, especially if you have a car. Your parents might have you pay insurance or something like that. or you have your phone bill taking over, or maybe you're just like taking over utility in the house. But when you turn um, a full-fledged adult, like 18, 20, and up, and especially if you live on your own for this one, you have bills. Con number three, having to deal with government and work stress in life. My friend actually is going to do something right now. She is pregnant and she works at Target, where they won't change her position because they don't feel that the doctor's note saying that she can't bend is good enough reason. So there's you know, things like that, being treated unfairly at work, having to stand in line and take care of government problems that take hours. It's things that your parents used to do for you. Con number four, responsibilities, which pretty much sums up everything that I've put down, but with an added twist. Responsibilities cover everything from taking care of someone if you have kids, taking care of your bills, making sure you don't get in trouble, making sure there's food in the house, everything is clean, no one's gonna clean it up for you anymore. The chores and stuff that your parents had to do when you were growing up, now it's time to put that into action. If you live on your own, even if you don't, you still wanna put that into action just to show that you are responsible. If you're responsible, it'll be seen by people and it'll pay off in the end. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I like making it always, and if you did enjoy it, be sure to click that thumbs up. Leave a comment on some other cons and pros that you have noticed now that you're an adult. I really, really love your guys' feedback. We'll hopefully be back on Saturday with Legend of Korra, as always. So, thank you guys!